Do you want to see how to make $121 a day with Google? In this video, I'll show you how for free. You don't have to sell anything. You don't have to recruit anyone. You don't need any skills. You don't need any experience. You can do this in less than an hour a day. You just need a computer and an internet connection. Also, if you stay to the end, I'm going to show you a free tool that will do the work for you, but you have to stay all the way to the end of this video. If you're into entrepreneurship and making money online, subscribe to my channel, click the bell notification so you get notified every time I do another video. Also, if you want to get my number one recommendation to make two to $500 a week, click the link in the description. Linda Bamba here. I am a full-time internet marketer. You want to stay on this video all the way to the end because if you miss something, you'll get confused. This won't work. You won't make any money. It's just super simple. A first grader can do it. Anybody can do it and so can you. There's going to be a number of websites that we're going to use in this. And I am going to give you a free tool at the end. We'll actually do the work for you, but you've got to stay to the end. So one of the first sites we're going to be using is called listfirst.com. Um, and this is a site where people, they're looking for people, um, they'll pay you, and, and you can see here, uh, there's a lot of ads on here, that's how this site makes money, but people are writing like top 10 list of different uh, strange things, like top 10 tone deaf celebrity coronavirus messages that are cringy, top 10 things you need to do to prepare for coronavirus, and right now we're in the middle of this, here's another one about the coronavirus, um, so, that that's it's a really a trending topic right now, but you can see this one's top ten actual facts about Coldale Silver. I'm not even sure what that is. Top ten tips from history on how you can survive a depression, and you can see all of these. So the first thing you want to do, you want to sign up for this. If you come down here and you go and you click write and get paid, they will pay you a hundred dollars uh, for every list that you submit. You can see that they do. You'll see these ads popping up. That's how they the site actually runs and it makes money but do you want to earn money online list first was built on the efforts of readers like you readers who didn't have any experience as writers but decided to put a list together and send it in so here's the deal we'll pay you a hundred dollars for your effort you may be thinking well you don't know how to write how can you come up with a list I am going to show you a free tool we'll actually do this for you um, and some resources on how that will do this for you but it works like this you write your t 10 item list minimum and you send it in and we reply and say great we'll publish it and they send you a ten dollar hundred dollars by paypal now if you don't have a paypal account and you live in a country where you can't get one go out to google search virtual private network set it to the united states and you can set up a paypal account um, so really anybody can do this uh, and they do pay out by paypal so once you get signed up you want to go over to uh, this is another site um, called oops my uh, thing did not come up here, called Article Factory. And you can see this is um, a site where there's all kinds of different things. I don't know why this keeps coming up. Let's try this again. Article. Go out and search for it again. I was just on it. Okay, this is it. Not sure why it wasn't come up. It's articlefactory.com. This is a site where you can come get articles and use them. They they have resale rights. There's no um, publishing issues. They're royalty free. You can use them. And if I just come over here and I search entertainment. Um, you can see there's different articles and like this one, here's one that top seven best whoever based Bay, hoverboards based from top review ratings, seven be, best seven forces in the world. And you can use, you know, you can start looking for different ones. You can also do a search um, on, on different topics. You can see there's all these different things over here. I just picked entertainment. And if I happen to do, if I do this one, the seven best hoverboards, what you want to do is you want to go to Google Docs. Uh, it's free. Set up a, a and, and get a document there. And you can see they're listing out here the top seven to choose. You just want to copy these seven, and you can use um, and you can come up with a couple more com by coming over here or searching on Google. But you want to copy these, copy it onto your clipboard. Go to Google Docs, create a document. 
If you don't have a Gmail account, if you get one, you can get this. And I'm, I pasted here um, the seven different ones that they're giving you. you and you'll probably have to do some editing on this and take out, you know, take a little of this out. And once you get your um, list here, and I am going to show you a tool that will actually do this for you. Um, so you're not copying, you know, Article Factory. This is this is royalty free here on Article Factory. But so you want to kind of make this a little bit of your own. Um, you can come over here and click top hover so you can get another three. Once you get it set up, you get your, your list here. Once you get it set up here on, um, and you've got your 10, and you've got it here on your, your Google Docs here, I'll show you the free tool in a second, but this tool will actually do it for you and actually turn this into, uh, and I, this isn't numbering correctly, so you're going to want to come in here and manually do two, do three and and there is probably some editing you're gonna to have to do that looks like you want to do spell check on these some of these words may be just to spell check it but once you get that the tool we're going to use is called spin pot spin bot what you want to do is you get your your list you paste it in here you get your text now took the numbers out you may have to go back to Google Docs and put the numbers in yourself you want to click I'm not a robot and you want to click go Okay, here's the re the rewritten text. So you can see they, they changed the title on this. What you want to do is when you get your finished product, you want to copy this off of here. You want to go back to um, list first and you want to click here. You want to submit a list. You're going to fill out your name, your uh, an email, a PayPal email address, a little bit about yourself. And then you want to paste your list in here. You want to give a title, you know, you copy copy your title off of this and put the title up here and we just take this out of here copy this put my title up here and then just put you know um, best of hoverboards in Amazon or whatever your title is and just give it a little bit you know say a, a line or two about it then you go ahead you you know you click I agree to terms and conditions and you submit it um, you want to read their payment terms um, and you know here when they say list must be your own work the reason you want to just don't take it off the of article factory and use spinbot is so you can turn it into and it's not the exact same thing so you're not completely copying stuff just read their terms so you understand it and then go ahead and submit it now you can do a couple of these a day I mean, you can really do this in 30 or 60 minutes a day if you start submitting these um, not of course all of them aren't going to get approved but you start getting you know one or two you know a week or even if you do one a week that's a hundred dollars what would an extra 400 do for you and you can use article factory another um, resource you can go to articlecity.com it's similar to Article Factory, and then you spin bot uh, to, to redo and respin the art the article, so it's a little bit different. So you're not copying the whole exact thing. So I hope you found value with this video. Please give it a thumbs up. Leave me a comment below. Let me know what you do. I'd love to hear from you, and I appreciate you watching. And I'll see you on the next video.